if you're looking for a way to resolve peer relationships in the workplace and to resolve conflict with other educators, then play Cards Against Irrationality. But before we dive in, let's meet the creators, our team. Hi hey everybody, my name is Kelly Gant. I am an early childhood and exceptional education major from birth through second. My undergraduate degree is also from Buffalo State, so I'm dual certified in first through sixth grade childhood education as well. Hello, my name is Caitlin Stickney. I'm currently a childhood and exceptional education major at Buffalo State College. Right now I'm working as a literacy specialist at the school in my area, and I'm currently working with grades two, three, and five. Hello, my name is Kaylee Redding. I recently graduated from the University at Buffalo with a bachelor's degree in psychology. I'm currently enrolled in Buffalo State Students with Disabilities grades 7 through 12 graduate program. I unfortunately do not have any certifications to be a teacher yet. However, I do sub at Lecture School and Elmwood Franklin School throughout the year. Hi everyone, my name is Emma Prino. I am currently enrolled in the Childhood Exceptional Education Program at Buffalo State College and I am a TA at an elementary school in the UPK program. Hi, my name is Kim M. Lucci McDuffie. I'm currently enrolled in the Graduate School at Buffalo State College, where I am majoring in students with disabilities grades 7 through 12. I hold a position at McKinley High School, the Buffalo Public School District, teaching English 12 Special Ed this year, and I do have a certification for Social Studies in History grades 7 through 12 with an extension to teach grades 5 and 6. Do you have conflicts with your coworkers at your workplace over co-teaching, planning, or even work style differences? Then this game will be perfect for you to play at your next faculty meeting or professional development. These real life conflict scenarios will make you a problem solving master in no time. You'll be closer than ever with your colleagues. I was on the verge of quitting my job because of things like lack of communication, discrimination, and major work style differences. All things that I'm sure you can relate to being in education. So I did some research and found out I'm not the only one. 86% of teachers report more educators retiring or leaving the profession since the start of the pandemic. 55% of teachers report they will leave the profession earlier than they had planned. And 8% of teachers leave the profession every year in the United States. A main reason teachers often feel burnt out and eventually leave the profession is due to conflict with other teachers and administration. That is why I got a team together and we created the Cards Against Irrationality to help teachers with their problem solving skills in the workplace. This will help decrease conflict and keep teachers in the profession, just like me. After playing this game and working it out with my colleagues, I definitely don't want to leave my profession, and this game helped me. Cards Against Irrationality was put together by a peer group of educators that were looking to build relations between educators, learning to solve common real-life scenarios and create a safe work environment. The purpose of the game is to come together as a team, to pair the question and the answer cards, to form the best solution to the problem. Playing the game is quite simple. The game is divided into teams. Each round, one team will choose a black card. This will have the scenario on it. Then, the other teams will work together to find a white card with the best solution to the problem. The team that chose the black card will decide which white card solves the problem the best. The team that won will receive the black card. As the rounds continue, the teams will receive more black cards. The team with the most black cards at the end will win the game. To set up the game, the teams will be seated in a circle. Each team will then receive seven white cards. These will not be shown to anyone besides the team members. The black cards will then be set up in the middle of the circle with the logo facing up. Once a round begins, the team that is judging will turn the black card over. As the other teams find a white card they want to play, they will place it in the center beneath the black card. The setup is quite easy and the game includes directions on how to set up the game. 
many places that conflict arises and unfortunately, conflicts occur at the workplace. Do you have conflict issues at your workplace? And do you ever feel like you are unsure of what to say to a coworker when a conflict arises? Well, here are a couple of examples of real life scenarios that you may experience in your workplace. If you notice that the general education teacher at your workplace is texting while they are supposed to be supervising elementary age children during recess, how would you react to the situation? If you experience any situations like this one, then this game is perfectly made for you. Here are different examples of some ways that people may respond to conflicting situations. Some of these examples may help relieve the conflict, but others may make them worse. As if you couldn't get enough of us, take us with you wherever you go. Cards Against Rationality is now available virtually on your phone. With friends, you can unlock a code which gives you and your friends the opportunity to play and problem solve wherever you are. Wherever you are, we are. Here is an example of us being with you on the go. Cards Against Rationality offers you the opportunity to solve problems wherever you are. How would you respond to the situation? Cards Against Rationality is not only a fun, lighthearted game for the break room, it is a valuable, innovative, and creative game. According to Maria from San Diego, this is the best game ever. I have never felt closer to my educational team. Thank you again, Cards Against Rationality. This game can be used in a way to actually help relieve tension and conflict in the workplace. Cards Against Rationality is the only card game that focuses on real scenarios for real people. Other card games out there may advertise that they can help with their problem solving skills, but Cards Against Rationality is the only true way. This game is also a great way to break the awkward tension in the faculty lounge by breaking out the Cards Against Rationality. Are you ever in the break room and you don't know what to say to your coworkers and it just feels awkward? Bring your game of Cards Against Rationality and watch the conflicts ease. This game can be fun, competitive, engaging, and energetic. Play with friends, family, or your colleagues. This simplistic, low-cost card game will prove its value as it strengthens your collaboration, communication, and other skills that will help you in the workplace. Also, don't forget to take us with you. We have a mobile app for problem solving on the go. If you have any questions about Cards Against Irrationality, please call 1-800-823-4249. Again, that's 1-800-823-4249.